um, for the Sagittarians and Moon and Rising Sun I'm so sorry um, the energy for the Sagittarians this is the week of the hair energy um, thank you for being here thank you for being back um, the week begins from the 5th until the 11th and in this week it's the energy of the star and the energy of the star as a zodiac energy from the hair this is a wonderful week for you guys because what is going to happen and what is going to transpire you're going to see this coming out I want to say thanks to each and every person and thanks to all you Sagittarians out there I so love you so much especially the people in Scotland and Ireland and uh, um, all over the world who has been um, listening and um, subscribing please remember to subscribe please remember to subscribe um, text the button now let's see what is happening for you Sagittarius and Monday you have the energy of the Queen of Swords in reverse this is wonderful this energy of the Queen of Reserve um, in reverse this is so someone who is over the age of 40 and is a um, scorpion no is a Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra this person is in the reverse form and is unable to affect you let's look and see what is happening on Tuesday you have the energy of the um, of the elephant energy of the elephant is organization it is someone this woman is in an organization that was lying and making mischief and she is now in the reverse form as we move forward we have the energy of the king of swords um, so these two people are in an organization and you are going to have to deal with them between Monday and Tuesday and then we have the energy of the seven of swords someone was trying to get away with something this is not going to happen okay as we move forward on Friday we have the energy of the wheel of fortune this is good because what this is saying is that this energy of the wheel of fortune is a karmatic um, situation that was happening and transpiring between you and this woman this woman is over the age of 14 is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra and there was a dishonesty that has transpired and but it is a karmatic situation okay so let's look at Saturday and see what is coming in you have the energy of the nine of swords in reverse and this is very wonderful and very positive whoever um, at these because this is a lot of sword airs that are coming up for you Sagittarians in this week on Sunday you have the energy of the four of cups so you're trying to build your life back and build on something this is the first time I am seeing and you have the energy vibration of the six of Pentacles a lot of people keep on receiving the energy of the six of Pentacles okay the six of Pentacles is that help is going to be coming in to you an organization or um, people around you or uh, uh, some situation is going to happen um, for you the energy of the six is very good um, because the energy of the six is letting you know especially the six of Pentacles that there is help that is coming in for you so let's move forward and let's take a look and let's see what is happening because there is so much energy of these swords um, people and what is happening is that the nine of swords is in the own the um, and the seven of swords you have so many swords you have queen of swords king of swords so you Sagittarians are dealing with these people the energy of the elephant is is good because the elephant an organization is bringing balance whoever that was trying to get away with something it's not going to happen and um, at the end of the day you have the energy of um, you have the energy of the nine of cups so your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through and the energy of the Sun comes out so if you look at your week this is how your week is looking your week is the energy of the six of Pentacles where help is going to be coming for you and whatever that has transpired the energy of the Sun is coming over you to shed light and bringing you success because people is realizing what has transpired what has happened and the energy of the Sun is kind of um, opening up to you and um, is about to protect you in this week 
the energy of the nine of cups my excuses on Sunday your wishes and dreams are going to be coming out because there is a situation that is happening for you which is going to be very positive and very beautiful um, the energy of luck is looking up on you because the close is um, is here at the foremost which is looking in on you and the energy of the close mid nine of cups is that a lot of wonderful things are going to happen in so let's ask the universe to show us what is the situation with the queen of uh, the queen of swords and this karmatic situation with this organization what exactly had transpired um, the okay so um, this is good because what has transpired is that there was a situation some of you could be could have been working at an organization and there was this woman who is um, the Queen of Swords who is an an Aquarius this person is over the age of 40 and she is an Aquarius a Gemini or a Libra and it is a karmatic situation that is transpiring and in this organization there could be is that she has lied about something and the rest of it but yet still there is someone this 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 person can be a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn we've seen the truth of something and she's going to um, make that pay out because she is going to be paying paying out um, paying you out okay because she's coming in with money for you and this is going to be good because she's going to see that something has transpired that wasn't true she's going to realize the truth of a situation okay so as we look forward uh, with the energy the three of uh, Pentacles is here because it's as if uh, um, in the unseen world your angels and guides are working with the organization and the eight of swords you're seeing the situation clearly about the king of swords so the king of swords and this queen of swords could be working in an the organization they lied about something and tried to work um, against you but this is not going to happen okay because this um, lady who is the knight of Pentacles, she is going to see and know that they were lying and she's going to do the right thing as we look forward we have the energy of the king of swords your wishes and dreams are coming to you and whatever they try to steal from you it's not going to happen because the money is going to come to you you know I love really really love you um, Sagittarians because whenever I'm doing a Sagittarians reading it's just like one of these things and you know what you do you always wonder where is the money for the Sagittarians because you know whenever you start to do the laying out of a reading for a certain sign there are certain things that is going to come up and all you had was you know just the earth sign with all these air sign and the fire sign which is the you know the wheel of fortune which is saying that there is this was a, a karmatic situation so I am happy because the last energy that you had for this week was the six of cups and the six of cups is bringing the situation to the nine of cups my excuses is bringing the situation to you because whoever this king of swords in the organization is because obviously this is a situation that has to do with work it's as if someone had lied about something or some people were trying to bring something and you know they you know whoever the queen of swords was you know this woman is as if you had helped this woman you know this woman you have helped this woman but she have worked together with this queen of sword this could be a brother or a sister this could be a brother and a sister situation and then this 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 Taurus or Virgos per, person come to the truth of a situation realize that there was lies and deceit that has happened and now she is trying to be honest and pay out what was supposed to pay out it was as if um, you were supposed to get some money and they lied about certain things and then this lady is really really seeing the truth of a situation and she decided that no I'm not going to let this go by this woman hasn't done anything and we you know I'm going to do the right thing and she's going to do the right thing because the next message that is coming up is that 
um, whoever this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is because she's someone over the age of 40 so it's gonna affect some of you in different ways because this is obviously a situation that has transpired it doesn't have to be work it can be in an on the organization or that sort of a thing but whatever that has transpired you are seeing the truth of a situation is now coming out which is so strange is that you're dealing with so many people in this um, this week because um, your crowning of the week is the seven of Pentacles someone the king of sword was trying to get away with a situation that he didn't want to pay you but now you're seeing the situation and someone who's a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman or a man is seeing the truth of the situation and they are going to be making this pay out to you so not to worry this money is going to come to you so if you were in a long battle or maybe it wasn't a battle maybe you have just walk away from a situation because something that has transpired you've decided this is not something for me this is not where I want to be in my life this is not the sort of a thing that I want to do in my life and these two persons which could be either a connection via organization or that sort of a thing came in and tried to did do something that was of injustice against you whoever that this woman is she is as if this woman is in a higher she is in a a, a, a better emotional balanced situation and she says oh my god this is injustice what they have done and she's seen the truth of the situation and she is going to work together with an organization to make sure that they pay you whatever that was supposed to give him so a little luck luck is in your chart for this week we are going to look at the energy that you came out of last week with in this week and it was the energy of observing and obviously you have observed a situation and this is good because you have stepped back from the situation you moved away from the situation so that you could let see the situation very good and now you come in this week being tactful and not really being tactful it's just as if the universe is working for you in this week because the universe is opening up and removing the lies and whatever that has been told and you're seeing and, and there is going to be happy happiness going into this week which you can see here that the situation is being resolved and there is going to be a sense of happiness coming out of this week going forward in the new week and this is good so let's look and see what the good Torah have to say about this week. Let's see what the good Torah have to say about this week. And it is um, the nine of water. Your wishes and dreams are coming true. So isn't this wonderful? Yes, it's wonderful. It's beautiful because you're moving um, forward in the next week and your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true because your financial situation is going to very much so in balance and this is going to be positive so whatever that was happening whatever that was transpiring um, as someone who is a Taurus or a Virgo whether a man or a woman however way it affects you is going to help you out of a situation that has transpired there's a lot of nine of cups that is coming up for a lot of people in this week it is a week of the um, the star and you can see this working for a lot of the other zodiac signs so congratulations again you um, Sagittarius is going to be a wonderful powerful week enjoy your week please remember to like share, and subscribe always try to subscribe if you haven't subscribed this is very good because what is happening is that the energies of the um, is, is changing and as you subscribe you have um, the capacity to listen to other um, readers and other channelers and I am a channeler I'm not a reader I'm a channeler and um, you can you know remember to go back in this week and listen to this week reading for your zodiac energies and listen to your sun moon and rising sign I want to say to you Sagittarius I love you guys so so much um, this is wonderful some of you will realize that you're um, you, you are moving back to one sign namaste until next time